everybody welcome back my name is Mari Ferry if you are new thank you so much for watching my video today's video is gonna be about doing a smoky eye like Kim K and we all know that Kim K is known for her smoky eyes new lips and that's what I'm trying to recreate in this video by anyways I'm not saying that I look like Kim K at all so don't don't say that in your comments please i'm not saying that i look like kim k i'm just trying to recreate her look her signature signature look that she's always does and show it to you in a very easy way so you can try try uh so you can try to do it as fast as you can so yeah this is the way that i did it and thank you so much for watching and let's watch the video sorry everybody i lost all my audio so now i'm gonna use this palette by morphe and madison beer and you can use any brown that you have already in another palette i'm pretty sure you have one i'm just using any you can use any brown i'm using this brown from this palette and i'm just going to apply it all over my lid this will be our transition color or our base color that i would use and I like to use it all over um, my lid and bring it out so it can go a little bit out of my eye and make my eye look bigger. I will do the same exact thing in the other eye. The same thing. And just apply the brown in our lid. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. This brown, it will be our transition color and that will be so now I'm just going to use a dark brown. You can use any dark brown. Like I say, you don't, don't have to be this one or this palette. I'm just using a darker brown from our the last color that we have. And I'm just going to apply it in the back of our eye. And just apply it as it will be like a B in our, our outer corner of our eye. Just apply it and blend it as much as you can so we can not see really um any... uh hard blending or nothing so it just be blended all together and this color is perfect i love how they blend the the eyeshadows they are super great quality so that's why i like this palette but that would be pretty much it just blending our dark brown in our inner corner so we can blend the two browns together and have our kind of a base for our a smoky eye look i do not like a super dark so yeah that would be pretty much it just blending those two brown and yeah that's all for our eyeshadow so now is the most important thing and this huda beauty eyeliner i fell in love like i'm sorry i already told you like three times but this is the huda beauty eye um eyeliner it has two sides one liquid which i'm gonna use now and i'm just gonna apply it out we always do our regular eyeliner that we do just keep it as close as we can to our line our top line of our eye i just i just like to keep it as close as i can and just um try to do my line as better as, as better as i can guys i'm not a pro on this eyeliner thing so yeah so i just like to follow in the uh to do my line up i used to i like to follow the line of my eye so it can look more bigger because my eyes they are very small and then i go back to the middle of my eye and just try to connect both lines as as you can see i just like to connect them from the middle and just filling out any um any spots that if they were not full just filling it out and that's pretty much it for my liner i don't do nothing um, ra um drastic or nothing that's all I just try to put a little bit of that and that's all. So as you can see, I already did my other eye out of camera. Uh, camera. So now I'm going to use the other side of our liner from Huda Beauty because it has two sides. It's one liquid and one pencil. So the pencil is gray. Like literally, this pencil does not move nowhere. It will stay in place the whole day the whole day guys i'm not lying so i'm just gonna apply apply the um the the pencil on side on my waterline and just trying trying to make it as dark as i can 
and just try to connect and uh, yeah try to connect oh uh, connect the liner in the back so it can don't look weird in the very back just put a little bit out of your eyes as you can see i like to put it a little bit out and connect it in the back and yeah this liner is great for this look and i'm just trying to make my eyes as, as dark as i can and same exact thing in the other eye i connect it in the back and then i put the black color all over my um liner oh my my waterline and you can use any um any liner that you already have so i'm just using this one because it's the one that i love as you can see um i need to stop doing promotion for huda beauty but yeah uh, i love this liner since i got it i love it and it's so dark and black the and it don't move guys i swear it does not move so that would be all for our liner so I feel like uh, using this black or any black that you have, just use it under our eye and try to blend it as near as we can to our line, uh, our waterline, but just blending it really good so we can get that smoky eye that we're looking for. I have a little bit of fallout, but it no matter. I will clean it after I finish and just setting our liner at the same time and blending this black color it will make a big difference setting our eyeliner it will make it stay in place the whole day so the eyeshadow that's what it would do it will set our liner and it will smoke our eye very nice which i love now the thing that i like to do is getting my liner my liquid liner and making a little line in the inner corner of my eye little line up little line down and making my eye look longer and you see the same exact thing in the other day, uh, side sorry i'm just gonna make one little line up and one little line down and connect it our eyes and that will be it and that's like a smoky eye look so now i'm apply a little bit of powder because i forgot in my other eye i, I like to do this before i do my um my black eyeshadows or my darker eyeshadows so it can catch any uh, fallout as you can see my other eye you can see all the fallout but i did apply it in this side to show you so i'm just gonna apply the same exact thing of um with my black eyeshadow so i can set up my um my liner and smoke my eye at the same time i'm just using this little pencil which is perfect i think it came in my boxy charm but i'm just using it and just um trying to smoke my smoke my eye as much as i can and yeah just applying it and trying to perfect it but yeah that would be pretty much it for our smoky look i'm just trying to make everything look great and finish our eyes so we can go to our next step So now what I'm going to do is to get a the brown that we use for our transition color. The first brown that you are use and uh, get the same brown that we use in our transition color and try to blend it under the black liner in the black eyeshadow. Just try to blend it as much as we can and trying to get the same look uh, as our top uh, eyeshadow and remember to bring it all the way back guys all the way back to our eyeshadow to our other um to our other eyeshadow just follow your liner and all the way back so it can be blended together and it can get connected in the back with all other eyeshadow So now I'm gonna use any color, or oh, you can use any color. I'm just gonna use this color from this palette, but you can use any highlighter if you want, which is easy for me and I always do. I'm just gonna use it to highlight my under under my brow, highlight under my brow, and I'm just applying it as near as I can to my brow. And exact same thing in the other eye. So now I'm just gonna curl my lashes like I always do. 
curl my lashes. I I like to leave it a little bit long um in my in each lash, but I'm just gonna curl it. I can curl it with any curl it that yeah already have. I'm just have this one forever. I don't even know how long, but yeah, have it forever. So now I'm gonna use my mascara and just apply one coat, guys. Just apply one coat if y'all gonna use um lashes. If y'all go, if y'all not using lashes, y'all can apply more than one coat and make it look as fuller as you as you want. But I'm just applying one one coat to my lashes, and I'm gonna apply one coat to the top lashes, and then I will apply one coat to my bottom lashes and that will be pretty much it for me for these eyes i'm gonna apply lashes after so that will be good for me just one coat and then i will apply my lashes the mascara i'm using is from maybelline i think it's called the total temptation and that will be pretty much it for my eyes guys so yeah that was pretty much it i just applied my lashes and i recommend um very dramatic lashes because from the darkness of our um eyes you will not see uh if you use very natural lashes so yeah i just use the lily lashes in uh, miami i think oh yeah because it's the only ones that i use <laughs> yeah so i i use the lily lashes and now because i don't know if you notice she likes a very bright under eyes so i'm gonna use her product and it's the number three uh brightening uh, powder so i'm gonna use it and uh, bright my under eye. And this powder is really good. But if you don't have this powder, you can use the one from um from uh the wedding wire. It's like a little thing. And yeah, that is a very good powder too. Almost it do for this one. And you can see this one is like super good already. So yeah, she likes a very, very bright under eye. And yeah, so that's why I'm brightening all my areas there that I'm using. So yeah, she likes the very bright under eye. I have this just because uh, it was from her brand. And you know, like she likes very dark eyes, very smoky eyes. And she likes very nude lips, which I love. And I'm going to use the same... Um, it's not this one <laughs> this one is number um her lip liner from kkw is number uh number two nude number two so i'm just gonna line my lips uh and top which this color is like this perfect dark brown like i love it as you can see in all my videos It's the perfect dark brown. So I'm line, And then with my finger, I'm just gonna mm, clean a little bit. And now I'm gonna use hair um, lipstick and nude number four, which I love too. She got a great taste. She does. So I apply it in the middle of my lips and just uh, try to fix it with my finger because but it's almost perfect like i love this uh combination and that's pretty much it this is how she would love to do her makeup like dark eyes very smoky eyes very new lips bright under eye and that would be pretty much it for her and i love it i love dark eyes and new lips so this is the final look guys what do you think i think it's beautiful i love it and i think it's a great look for for a night out uh dinner something like that yeah so yeah i love it i love nude lips and dark eyes smoky eyes i love it so yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you like it and i lost all my audio when i was recording <laughs> the eye look so i'm gonna talk about in the video but yeah thank you so much for watching and remember to subscribe 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 like comment and let me know anything in your comments not mean comments please because
Sometimes y'all being mean. But, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, let me know anything that y'all want, want me to do so I can know what y'all like. And remember to stay beautiful and stay safe. Bye.